Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. A stabbing in Crawley in a supermarket has landed a young woman back in trouble with the law just two weeks after turning herself in. News 10's Jasmine Dean, Jean, Dean rather, joins us now live from Crawley, where the stabbing actually took place. Jasmine. I'm here in Super One Foods in Crowley, where a stabbing took place on yesterday evening. Police Chief Jimmy Broussard tells me that the suspect involved in the stabbing was also involved in a hit and run incident just two weeks ago. Crowley police responded to a stabbing Sunday evening after reports of two people being injured. Police say the suspect, 22 year old Amber Ware, stabbed a Super One employee in an unprovoked attack. It is. It, at the present time, it is seen as an unprovoked attack. Um, we cannot determine anything. In fact, watching video, it doesn't appear that anything was said between the customer and the employee. The victim was taken to a local hospital to be treated for his injuries. Ware was arrested and charged with attempted second degree murder. Chief Broussard says the suspect was also involved in the hit and run accident on South LA 13 two weeks ago. She is also the driver of a uh, hit and run that became fatal. At the time, Ware was charged with a felony hit and run. The victim later died from those injuries. Now, the district attorney is investigating whether or not to include additional charges since the victim died. Chief Broussard says because Ware was involved in two different incidents, there will be different charges. Two different occurrences, two different charges. Uh, the first one being the felony hit and run, which again, if the DA chooses, they can up those charges. Uh, yesterday, she was arrested for attempted second degree murder. Right now, where is that the Acadia Parish Jail being held with no bond? In Crowley, Jasmine Dean, KLFY News 10.